Hello everyone, welcome back to Stalker Lost Alpha. So I made the journey to Professor Sakharov to pick up my helmet. Hello Marked One, you seem pressed for time. Are you here on business? Yes, I'm on a mission from General Veronin. We want to shut down the Brain Scorcher and X-16 for good and open up the path to the center. He said you have a Psy helmet that will protect me from the Psy emissions. Oh. Well, we had a fine-tuned Psy helmet that could have protected you from such strong Psy emissions, but I already sent it with one of our men to the Lost Factory Science Bunker. You can go there and ask my colleague Didi for it on my behalf. I do have an experimental prototype here with me which you can take. Is it any good? You're not just offloading a useless piece of junk on me, are you? It will help you reach the old road that leads to the Lost Factory, at least. You'll have to be quick, though. But beggars can't be choosers, right? Alright, thanks. I <laughs> received the not-adjusted Psy Helmet. Times one. Oh yeah, by the way, um, on the journey here, the artifact that I was making in my artifact merger actually finished. So here it is. I made a bubble! This heart-shaped artifact secretes a thick mucus-like liquid, which, if applied to a desired area, reduces effects of harmful chemical chemicals on said surface. Um, is that what I was trying to make? That doesn't... I thought I was making something else. That seems weird to me. But, uh, nonetheless, I guess I'll wear it. Cool. One kilogram. Prototype developed by scientists to protect people from psi emissions. Not adjusted. Okay. And along the way, by the way, I purchased ten things of fuel for the jeep, just to make sure that I don't run out. And some more armor-piercing rounds, too. Okay, so where do I need to go? Where's the... Where's the lost factory? That's to the dead city, right? Yep. And then where? Oh shit, it's all the way up there? Holy crap, okay, uh... Wow, I'm gonna be going to some new areas. Okay, well, I'll uh, cut here and come back when I'm to a new area. Alright, I am now heading into Radar. Which I don't believe I've been here. Or if I... Did I? Did I? Like I thought, maybe I kinda did but I never fully explored it. I really can't remember. I definitely haven't fully explored it. It's possible I've gone there briefly. I'm not sure. But then uh, after this, there should be an exit from a radar that links to the concrete factory or whatever it's called. And then maybe after this, we can go for a ride on the countryside. Critical site missions level. Leave this dangerous zone immediately. Oh, hold on. Shit. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, can I put this on? Oh, I put it up here, right? Right? Uh, maybe not? Maybe it's passive? Oh shit, hi! Uh, no, I don't want to leave. I am getting horrible FPS, holy crap. What the fuck are these things? Uh, I, I think I need to just go. Stalker. Wait, what? Was he talking to me? I think it's through a grenade. Okay, hold on. What the hell is happening? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I swear he was talking to me rather than trying to shoot me, but he showed up as red. And uh, I need to see if I can actually put this helmet on. I don't think I can. But let's just be sure here. Can't right click it. Can't put it up here. Can't wear it. I, I guess it's passive? I 
I mean, even though my head was getting messed with, it didn't seem like it was really doing much damage at all. So I guess I can just run through there. Alright. Let's go, and let's just keep driving. Because that looks like a fucking nightmare, whatever the hell that stuff was. It's almost like I was seeing things, like spectral forms of monsters. Okay, were you trying to talk to me? Hi. Stalker, come here and talk to me. Okay, he does want to talk. Okay. Stalker, come here and talk to me. You are oh, you're monolith. Hi. Hello. I, what the fuck? Let's let's talk fast, shall we? There's something big coming behind you. Okay, I'm just gonna shit my pants while we have this conversation. Hold, stalker, you are treading on holy ground. What is your business here? Uh, just going on a va just going on a vacay. While we have no problem with such matters, an offering to the monolith is needed. Five thousand. No more. No less. <laughs> How about I just spend that money on giving you proper funerals? Um, fine. Sure. are creepy as hell. Okay, so I'm good to go, right? Okay, cool. I kind of want to make them my enemies just to get their weapons so I can sell them for money. But let's be a nice guy for now. Alright, this is going to be a bitch. Holy crap. Driving was hard enough before. Is this piles of garbage? I don't know, let's just go. I think that was an artifact back there. Given how kind of a high level zone I'm in, I think it could be very valuable. Stone flower? Jellyfish. Oh, oh, slow down, slow down, slow down. Slow down. Okay, I really don't want to run any of you over. Shit. Oh, this guy. Look at him. He's having a grand old time. Tripping balls. Okay. I'm guessing, if anything, the Psy emissions are going to get worse here. I need the adjusted helmet. A couple screws are loose, I guess. They're the tiny kind, the ones so small that nobody has a screwdriver small enough to actually turn them. Yep, still here. Alright. But, oh my god, they're 2600 meters away? What the hell? How big is this place? Wait, that th you're taking me through the countryside? What the hell? Why? Where does this go? Metal factory? What the hell is a metal factory? I'm not even sure. I just thought there'd be a easier way to get there, but anyway. Okay, well, anywhere, any place I want to visit in the countryside? Something interesting going on here. Thank God I've got a car, because this looks like the perfect place to drive. Oh, my brain is actually fine. Okay. Brain pain is gone. Hold on a second. It's starting to get dark, so I'm actually going to take a nap. Right in the middle of the road. The safest place possible. Please don't get eaten in your sleep by a bloodsucker.
I left the Jeep's light on the entire time. Thankfully, it's got uh, energizers. They just keep on going. Oh, look at those sun shafts. Beautiful. Yeah, this place is beautiful. It's all green. It's got a big, wide open road. No obstructions. No anomalies in the road so far. It's a wonderful place to drive. What's an artifact? Oh no, that's a poltergeist. Yeah, there's a flame poltergeist on my left. Okay, I'm nearing the weird thing on the map. Whoa! Something just exploded. Okay. Oh god, it keeps happening. I'm just gonna keep going. What the fuck is that noise? happening. Oh, I was just pressing the wrong button for the flashlight. <laughs> Hi. Uh, I think my head hurts a lot. I'm assuming I'm here? Yeah, they must have picked me up. That or I just blacked out the entire trip. Hi. Oh dear, you don't look well. Take this. It will help with the symptoms you're experiencing. Headaches. Tinnitus, whispers, and, in about 50% of cases, a strange craving for alcohol. Please don't drink in here, though. Forbidden by regulations. Stick to anti-rat and other proven medicines. Thank you. Uh, what's your name? Dee Dee. Not my real name. Opted for a code name to avoid complications. It's good that you're holding up. Oh, it's good that you're holding up, stalker, and lucky that my search party found you in the countryside. But I must ask, what brings you to such a craven place? I can count the number of non-military visitors I get monthly on a single hand. Your colleague Sakharov sent me to fetch a fully functional Psy helmet. He must have mentioned me. Ah, yes. I did get a notice about you. Marked one, right? Never thought you'd make it here with a monolith and scorcher around. And that unadjusted Psy helmet served you well. Unfortunately, I don't have what you want. I sent some field workers into the countryside to take some measurements for further fine-tuning. But they never returned. And the search party were out looking for them. You never saw them by some chance, did you? No. Never had a chance when the blowout came out of nowhere. Don't worry. I'll keep a lookout for your men while I search for the helmet. I'll be keeping the helmet if I find it, as Sakharov promised. Just point me in the right direction. Of course. The last sight of them was at the old water dam in the underground tunnels. <laughs> the, the water dam. The damn water. D-A-M-N. Damn water. I will mark the area for you. Here, take these. They help a bit. But you must hurry. That helmet is far superior than that old prototype you have. And look after it, because it's thrice as expensive. Okay. Uh, what do you sell? 
Nothing too good. So... I have to run all the way to my car, don't I? Or, oh wait, shit, what? Everything went dark for a second, I thought uh, it was teleporting me again or something. So, do I have to find the helmet while I'm, like, blacking out? Holy shit. Shall I use the X-Virus Antidote right now? Oh wait. Everything seems, everything seems fine. Okay, everything's fine. Oh cool, look at that. The camera actually follows me. Although it's quite dumb and easy to fake out. Where did I go? Can't find me? Oh, there. Found me. I wonder what's in the rest of this place. Holy shit. Okay, yeah. Views going in and out. I guess I better get running. It's going to be a long run. Thankfully, I have a decent amount of energy... I was going to call them potions. Energy potions. Also known as energy drinks. Those would be the monolith people. Thankfully, I paid them. Oh, never mind. Military? Yep, looks like it's a military. Okay. Stay on the road, stay alive. Understood, fine gentlemen. By the way, I killed like a hundred of you and took all your weapons. Whoa. What the fuck? You were warned, Star. Are you kidding me? Y you were warned. Yes. Yes, I was warned. Let, let's take a look at what you warned me about. Stick to the road, and all will be fine. Where was I when you started shooting me? On the road. Okay. You wanna play this game, huh? Nice throw. Fucking dicks. Yeah, keep popping your head up. I'll keep mowing you down. Money. I don't even care to loot them. I'll take their weapons when I have my car with me. Oh sweet, okay, so where I actually need to go is not all that far. Although I do obviously want my car back, so I'm probably gonna have to go a bit further. Unless my car magically teleported to the water dam, which it probably didn't. It's a pretty special car, but it's not that special.
Oh yeah, by the way, somebody suggested that I call the car Stretch Armstrong, which I like quite a bit. I think I'm gonna shorten it to Stretch. Just cause it's polygons like to flex their, well, polys. It's very flexy. So my good old Jeep, Stretch. I'll probably forget that like two seconds later. So he sent a team of people out here, and he lost contact with them. So I'm probably going to find something nasty. Holy shit. Oh my god. Holy crap. freaking shack up there with some bones in it. Can you actually get there and then get back? How? Oh my god. I don't see any way to get back up. Yeah, let's avoid going down there, shall we? Lots of flames around here. Flame anomalies. Whoa. What the hell? What am I hitting? It's like some force is repelling me. Oh, okay. It stopped. What's going on here? Whatever it is, I'm assuming it's mutant, so I'm going to switch to normal shots. And let's go auto. Come on, you muties. Show yourself. Some ammo I don't need. Ooh, medkit. Take that. Medkit. So I think they're below me. Right? And they're further down yet. What if there's an entrance down there? Well, I mean, they can't be above me, since there is no above me, so... Yeah, pretty sure they're below me. Oh, wait, wait. There's a hatch. Does it work? Yes. Oh. It's a freaking box. Never mind. Actually, I think... Yeah, I think it's down here. Yep. I'm so sorry. I keep doing that. I touch the bodies and they explode in a puff of dust. <sighs> Find the passage to the underground. That's what I just did, is it not? Find the underground tunnels. 
I guess I'm not quite there yet. This place seems pretty well lit. Which is refreshing. Aw, oh, I can't grab up that. Wanted some more fuel. But it was not to be. Oh, that's me. <laughs> I thought something appeared in front of me. It was just my character model spawning. For the cutscene. I found the entrance, but the tunnel is collapsed, and the way is blocked. There is an old colleague of ours that lives nearby in the abandoned church. He goes by the name of Hermit. He will surely know another way in. I'll mark his position on your map. Go there and talk to him. All right, sounds like a plan. Find another way. Yeah, it looks like he's not too far away. 400 meters. No problem. Ah, green parasite. Yoink. I'm like a artifact hoover. I just suck him up as I run. There's something very creepy about living inside of an old, broken church in a kind of post-apocalyptic world. Hey dude, there's an artifact on your doorstep. Yoink. Ah, that's a pretty good one. 2,500. Not one I want to use, of course, but in terms of value, it's relatively good. You look like a bandit. Never thought I'd see a fresh face today. It's pretty lonely around here, like, all the time. What brings you around these parts, mate? It's a long story. Short version is that I need to find an unblocked passage to the abandoned underground. Dee Dee from the bunker not far from here said you might be able to help. Ah, Dee Dee. I haven't seen him for a long time. Not a very hands-on type, but a very good scientist nonetheless. I know where you can find a proper entrance. Should I take you there? Um... It depends on whether he's going to teleport me there, because if he wants to teleport me there, I'll take it. But if I'm going to have to, like, babysit him, then nope. So, hold on. Let me save it. Sure. Okay, yeah, hell no. Nope. I am not going to babysit him.
shit. <laughs> Whoops. I uh, thought it was a couple more options into the dialogue tree. Okay. Come by sometime. We can share some tales of adventure with a vodka or two. It's got nothing on him. Right there, huh? That's weird, it's not actually showing up on my mini-map in the top left. Is that a picnic? Oh, vodka! Energy drink. Come here. Uh, I'll take these two. Yeah, why not? Let's make the trip fun. Wee! Oh yeah. Traveling in style. But up bum bum. Almost there. I uh, don't suppose that tractor's drivable, is it? Jellyfish. Okay, this place is busy. We're going deep, deep underground, aren't we? Unless the buttons don't actually work? Oh no, we're still going pretty deep down. Oh god! Oh god. What the hell's down there? Hi. There's more. Oh yes, there's more. I'm gonna have to use AP rounds. Shit. I think I need to go single shot. This could serve a little bit more ammo. Okay, thankfully they're very dumb. Come on. No? 
Okay, because I'm not getting up there. Are they marked my map? Maybe? Seems more like that's the entrance marking rather than the scientists. Acrobatic! No body parts. <laughs> that damn sound. That squeaky light bulb sound. That noise is so damn creepy. It's a very distinctive noise. I uh, remember it quite clearly from the original Stalker, I think. Okay, zombies. What is this way? Nothing. Should I even waste ammo on them? No, I'm not going to. Shit, it's one of those. Break line of sight. You have to break a line of sight. Oh, okay. That's nothing. It's nothing. Ignore it. Ignore it. Ow, brain pain. Did I get it? I don't see the... Oh, there it is. There's the body. Okay, I got it. I will gladly take your foot. Alright, the brain pain is getting worse. Fuck, I can barely see anything. Jesus Christ. I need to get the damn helmet. I need to get the fuck out of here. Looking for a body or something. I don't see anything. So where the hell is it that I need to go? Nothing back here. I'm wondering if these zombies might be one of the one of the guys. Probably not though. It seems unlikely. 
What am I missing? Is her body crammed in one of these corners? Seems unlikely. Can't you use the machine? I'm not sure where to go. Seems like where I was supposed to go. I mean, given how hard that enemy is to kill, it seems like that is the end encounter, you know? But, uh, let's try this way. Oh, never mind. Yeah, there's a bunch more down here. Unless... wait a minute, is it just loop around? No, this is new. Yeah, this is definitely new. Holy shit. That's gonna be a problem. I'm not even gonna waste ammo on them. No way. Is this also not where they are? Oh shit, they're coming. They're coming. Dead end. I'm pretty sure this just goes back to the room I was already in. I hear a bloodsucker. Oh, I see a bloodsucker. Hi. A little bit hard to hit when they're running around like that. Uh... Okay. Okay, this is also new. I think, unless I'm going backwards. This place is confusing. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Found him. Yep, nothing else here. Functional Psy Helmet, thank god. Ah. Find the emitters. Wait, am I supposed to find the emitters down here? Is this lab... X-16? No, no, that's here. Oh, it's just the underground entrance is still marked, right, okay. Okay, so I need to go back to the concrete factory. So, first step is to get the hell out of here. I think I can remember how to do that. Maybe. This is actually not the room I came from, is it? Nope. Okay, I think it's back this way. And 
This way? I think this is the main room, right? The one I came from? Yes, okay, sweet. Get me the hell out of here. Ah, beautiful, beautiful daylight. Bathe in it. Alright, I really want to go back for my car. Which is precisely what I'm going to do, so I'll be right back. There you are, Stretch. Okay, I need some more supplies. I've been going through a lot of ammo. Picked up a bunch of artifacts on the way. Dump those, got a body part. Yeah, I need a bunch of ammo. Definitely need, definitely need more armor piercing as well, because I have none stored up. I've blown through pretty much all of it. Okay. Let's go back to concrete. Should be a fun ride for the... What the fuck was that? My jeep just ran out of... Out of fuel, and it fishtailed because of that. And like, spun completely around. Also, I think there's a bandit trying to shoot me. Let's take a look in a second. Uh. <laughs> I know exactly what to do. Full speed ahead. That didn't quite work. Please don't shoot me. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. Yep, worked fine. Wait, one of them's still alive. Oh, what did, did you just walk through the... He just walked through the guardrail. I kind of feel bad for him. I actually feel really bad now that he's screaming in pain. Can I give him a medkit? I'm pretty sure you can. I can't. God damn it. <sighs> Alright, I'll put him out of his misery. I'm not even going to load up their weapons. I just feel bad now. Anyway, like I was saying, it should be a good ride because the road is very, very open. So you can pretty much just go full speed. Oh, crap. Well, shit. Come on. Come on, we get to do this dance again. Except for some reason, this dance doesn't seem to be working. Huh? Huh? Almost did. Oh, for the love of God. Come on. I can see you're trying. Oh. 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 It's close. It's close. <sighs> well, this is fun. Oh. What the f Okay, all I had to do was back up and it worked. Right. Yeah, I killed these bandits on the way through here, by the way. A couple of assholes.
Ooh, you know what? I can actually go off-road and save a lot of time. Yeah, cut across that whole thing. Oh shit. Oh no! Oh, it's fine. Nope. It's not fine. Ooh, that sounded really nasty. Juicy. When the hell did I last save it? Oh, it's just a second ago. Okay, sweet. I did not even see that. There it is. Let's go to the left of it. Okay, I think we're good now. Come on, I dare you. Cross the road, boar. The hell? I could have sworn I clipped it. Just passed right on through. Actually, it might be a good thing, because I might have just exploded otherwise. More bandits! Hi! Holy shit! Yeah. Get him, dogs, get him. I don't even know what the fuck happened. How did I flip? Wait, where the fuck am I going? Jesus Christ. Uh, the air you can get in this thing. Good old stretch. The grass can't even keep up with my car speed. I'm racing the grass, come on. I'm gonna win. There's an artifact there, but I don't care. I'm not slowing down. I've got a bet with the grass. Come on. We're neck and neck. I can do it. Whoever loses has to drink ten of those huge canisters of olives. Eh. In my mind, I won. Gotta be very careful here. Okay, I think that's it. Yeah, there we go. Stand in front of the camera for DNA verification. Uh, what? DNA cleared. Please explain to me how you're identifying my DNA through a camera. Because I don't think that's possible.
Yeah, I don't even have to go back inside. Just need to go eliminate the emitters, but I do want to see if I can... Cool. Um, <laughs> I don't know what's going on with that smoke. Right. Anyway, like I was saying, I really need some armor-piercing rounds, so please tell me you sell them. Please, please, pl nope, nope, he doesn't. Alright, I'll just buy some standard ammo. Better than nothing. I think that's all I need. Yeah. The finest recruit. Alright, well, I think I'm going to end the episode here. So when I return, I will try to find the emitters in Lab X-16 and shut them off.